One of my favorite memories of Sonny's is, do you remember the blackout? I remember that the next day we went to Credit River. We swam the- Did I stutter? The entire afternoon in Credit River, and then after we came here- Ew! How's it going, everybody? Welcome to an episode of The Hangry Cure. I'm Brandon, and I'm joined with my friend Christopher. And today, we're gonna go to a very exciting place in Brampton. It's actually one of my favorite burger joints of all time. It's called Sonny's Drive-In, but the sign says Sonny's Charcoal Broiled Foods. It's located at 21 Kennedy Road, Brampton North. If you want the postal code, well, I'll give you that too. It's L6V1X5. My grandparents came here in like the 60s and they still remember, oh yeah, Brian, we remember Sonny's. Sonny's is Sonny's good food, boy. <laughs> My personal favorite hangry cure here is specifically their poutine and their regular cheeseburger. I love that. It's just oh. unmatched. So I'm gonna show you that meal. Their poutine, it's delicious. It's kind of like soup in a way. It's just so oh, it's liquidy. It's just loaded. It's loaded with gravy and cheese. One of my favorite Sonny's memories, it was May 2 4 weekend. Chris's cousin Jenny, who is not here right now because she's triggered by this memory, she set me on <laughs> fire in a park. She did. She set me on fire. She um, ran at Brandon with a can. When with I was the, on fire, uh, candlestick. I pulled my sweater off and the sweater ripped and she stabbed me again with the firework and it exploded on me. Oh. 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 Did you rip off your shirt? Are you good? She burned me. We went to Sonny's right after that happened. It must have been like two o'clock in the morning. I had like the ash. Yes, from the yeah, yeah. You look, you looked all like messed My up. My sweater was I ripped open, and literally everyone was eating their food, and they just stopped and they looked at us. We looked like we literally got into yes. a bar fight, and it was two against like thirty people. So Sonny's only takes cash. So if you're coming here expecting to pay debit or credit, you can't. Bring cash. Only cash. They have an ATM inside. Anyways, guys, we're gonna head inside now, and you're gonna see just how perfect this place actually is. All right, Chris, as always, since you're my guest, you can go first, please tell us. Oh, uh, first off, the smell, as soon as I opened it. So what's this one called? The Banquet Burger. Oh, look at that nice, fresh strip of bacon. Oh my, oh my goodness. I always find that onions, when they're cut up into like little squares, for some reason taste better, better than the rings, right? Yeah. <laughs> I don't mean the onion rings, I mean like the full onions. Yes, the full, the full onions. Something about it just looks more visually appealing to me. But you see what I mean though, how the poutine's kind of like a... Like a soup? It's like a pool, yeah. in a way. The cheese, the cheese is so good. Yo, Brampton is wild, man. We've been doing a few of these episodes together now. I'm glad that you're watching out for your diet. I'm trying to watch my weight. This is like a swimming pool of poutine. I love it. Holy smoke. See, that's what's nice. That's what's nice about the strands versus the curds. Like, I love cheese curds, but I love the strands because they melt everywhere. Mm. Oh, the best is when you just find clumps of the cheese. And I love the classic tray. The classic tray, the classic box. This that is like change. No man, this is what you'd see at like a drive-in theater. It's crazy though, you can just eat this alone and you're full. One thing I forgot to ask, I know it's weird, but like my Lizzie's, I put onions on my food. You know, you also like to put onions on pizza. Yep, onions on everything. My poutine and my cheeseburger were 1520. Cheeseburger is 580, the poutine is 620, the water was 145. Mine, mine was 1985. It's not bad. Great. There it is. I put everything in this. This is everything you need in a burger. Oh. Cheese, pickles, onions, grilled onions, mayo, ketchup, mustard, tomato, lettuce. Okay, here we go. Yeah, you got a lot. Mm. 
That's like the best burger I've ever had. Jesus. As soon as I bit into it, I was like, this, this is it. This is the best burger in Brampton. I don't care what anyone says. It's like a smoky taste to that patty. I want loaded. a thick burger. That's what I like. I like a thick one. See, I wish I got the, the lettuce. I really forgot to get the lettuce. Mm. <laughs> Always the saddest part. When you get to the end. Mmm. Mm. This is the best burger in Brampton. Oh, this is the best burger in Brampton. This is the, the best down. This is the burger. best burger in Brampton. In Brampton. And then, of course, you have to leave some fries at the end. Even though that I'm satisfied, I could totally eat another one. It's Seriously? So, it is so good. The poutine alone would fill you, but that burger is just, you can't resist just getting the burger too. You need the whole combo. You need the poutine or you just need the fries. Because... The exhaust and the vehicle are so loud, and you would think it's a fast car driving by. It's not. But he's not moving. He's not even, he's going to speed limit. All right guys, so we just finished up at Sunny's, and that food was, like, it was so filling. Like honestly, you could see the portion is just, for what you pay, it is very generous. That poutine is like its own little swimming pool. Oh my goodness. The cheese strands, the beautiful thing about cheese strands versus cheese curds in my opinion is cheese curds, I find when you put them on your poutine and then have the gravy on it, it melts kind of like in one spot. Yeah. The nice thing about putting the cheese strands the way they do it at Sunny's, all thing. across, yeah. it melts all across. So you get that nice cheesy flavor all across the top. Now the burger, it's a charcoal broiled burger and it's delicious. They have it on the charcoal grill as you saw in the clip earlier. That to me, there's no comparison and I love how thin their patties are it's got a smoky taste to it and the nice thing about these burgers the way i do it personally i load it up i put everything on it it turns out to be a massive massive burger afterwards so my hangry cure my recommendation is if you're in brampton specifically on kennedy road in queen stop by sunny's you're not going to be disappointed it's been here forever sunny's will probably be here long after we're here put it that way it's just it's too popular i've never tried all their menu options but i haven't been disappointed to date with what i've tried here there's a few other things i want to do and chris made a suggestion so what we're going to do is we're going to come back one night because you need to see sunny's when it's lit up at night it's a whole different ball game you really get that nice 1963 vibe and you can see kind of what the glory of the 1960s looked like. Anyways, everyone, that is the end of this episode of The Hangry Cure. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon. And if you're ever in the Brampton area, I highly recommend that you make a stop at Sonny's because if you're craving a fresh burger or fries, you will not be disappointed. And that's it. So I'll see you in the next episode, guys. Stay frosty. Don't chase me. Don't chase me. Don't chase me. Stop. I didn't light it yet. Ooh. Stop. Where's the lighter? Where's the lighter? I don't know. Jenny, give me the lighter. I don't know. Oh, I got one. Yeah, Morgan! Where's your sweater? I ripped it. <laughs>